and I'm back down at the uh, the uh, the dry dock here, the Thompson dry dock, uh, where the Titanic was built, and I'm on the other side of it. But I didn't really mention um, yesterday whenever I was down, and I took uh, some footage of the dry dock to give you a say, the idea of say, this that lady just passed me a minute or two ago. I might go down to the bottom myself in a minute, have a wee, wee look. But I didn't really mention this um, end bit. You see this rusty bit? That is a, that is a Cassian gate. And that is, that is from the time of the Titanic as well. That was floated into position. Uh, and, and, uh, it can be moved, as I say, and there was a there's a Cassian gate back up uh, near the pneumatic uh, at the end of the pneumatic dock or where it's docked. This is a, a, a Cassian gate, folks, and it's a, an amazing structure. But I'll maybe take a wee dander down now that I'm here. I'll go and, go and retrieve my helmet in case I might fix it uh, off the bank sitting up there. The Titanic dock, or Thompson dock, where the Titanic was built, and the Cassian Gate here. And it gives the, uh, it gives the, the depth, mar depth markings it's just on the side of the wall there, if you can just see them. Apparently this um, this dock's about 44 feet deep, 44 feet deep, and there's one of the big uh, capstans, there's another one, and they're, they're all over the place uh, that the Titanic would have been uh, tied up to, the Titanic graving dock, right, see you in a minute.